we aren't pink and sprinkles and all of that kind of stuff. Um, that's just not really my vibe, I guess. <laughs> so what is the vibe of Wentworth and Fenn? To understand that, first, you have to meet the talented owner, Sam Allen. I think the pastries and myself are alike because we are very interesting to look at. Um, <laughs> Um, I think we're different just because sometimes the pastries are more simple than me because I'm, I'm a lot of layers of um, being extra and overthinking and doing all this stuff. I think everything kind of flows, flows together, pastries, bakery, me. And she has her own take on a food truck. I wanted something vintage and that's how I ended up with a 61 Shasta camper as a store. <laughs> and her name is Selma. So. <laughs> She isn't running out of ideas anytime soon. The sky's the limit, in my opinion, for the flavor profiles that we have at the bakery. I'm just thinking and you know going through the motions of the day and an idea hits me. I have nine million notebooks that I carry around with me because I can't remember anything unless I write it down. So <laughs> I'll write down stuff all day long or I'm sure people who see me, I always have a pen in my hair and sometimes I don't have paper so I'll write stuff down on my hands which blends in with the rest of it so you know <laughs> even through all the trials and tribulations of owning a business she is staying true to herself I'm proud of just sticking to my guns with how I want my pastries to be everybody has their niche but I'm, I'm just proud that I stayed true to how I wanted all of my pastries to look how I wanted them to taste um, there's a lot of trends out there some of those trends I really don't like <laughs> um, so just kind of staying true to what I wanted to do this whole time. As always, this is Charlotte Served. I just, I just bake things. <laughs> I just bake things. I don't know. <laughs> so. Okay, good.